<laughs> Dominus Rex, are you ready, guys? This is it, the moment we've all been waiting for. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World, the game. Yes, I can't seem to keep it alone, or keep keep off it. I definitely don't want to keep it alone. And we have some amazing news today. You've probably seen the thumbnail. You've read the title. Um, yes, that's right. It finally, after so long, I've managed to get... Indoraptor. Although we haven't made it yet, so I thought I was going to save that for me. So, I mean, you, you, me and you can do it together, you know. But not only that, but Monostegatops is now in the game. Um, and you will probably, uh, I mean, I've, I haven't actually opened this since um, yesterday, or two days ago, actually. Just because I've been super busy. Well, actually, I'll get into that in a minute once we just, uh, <laughs> not super busy. I was, I was preoccupied, let's just say. Um... So, eh, not really worth anything there. Uh, we'll collect that, we'll collect that. And I think, actually, we, the boss event is done. Hell yeah! So that is another alpha. Um, I'm not really going to place that down, because once you place an object or a decoration, like a building, a decoration or a building, you can't then uh, put it in... What do you call it? You can't just then. Oh, it's got no eyeball there in that trophy. Oh my god! You can't take. You can't put it in storage. So once I place it down, they kind of have to stay there. So that's why I've only placed one down of each of these because I do have some extra ones. Um, but we're gonna go into this and we're gonna do that. So I'm super excited. I know that it's only gonna be a level ten in Raptor. I know it's not gonna really be as good as anything that I've got in top like my top ten dinosaurs, but. We'll collect that. Um, yeah, we completed that. There it is! Now you get exactly the same a Monolophosaurus DNA as you do Velociraptor DNA. So the leaks were true. The Super DNA is indeed a Monolophosaurus, which means that the other DNA that we have still yet to get is, of course, going to be um, Pyroraptor, meaning that it's going to be... I mean... We have Indoraptor, we have a Monostegatops, which only existed in Jurassic World Alive before this game, before it came to this game. Um, and the other uh, Pyro uh, hybrid that exists in Jurassic World Alive is, it's either going to be Pyrotator, or it's going to be the next one up from Pyrotator, which is like, a, it's, py, it's Pyrotator and Dimetrodon making... Pyrotator Don, it's something like that. So it's either going to be Pyrotator or a Dimetrodon sort of looking thing, like Megan and Rato. I don't know what it's called. But anyway, there we go. Two of them adding to two Monolophosaurus DNA. And uh, oh, look, there he is. Um, they always look so weird. They're extra slimy. I <laughs> see everybody put this in their thumbnails. I'm like, it looks bloody gross. Uh, but the interesting thing is. It's got a very, very elongated snout in comparison to its Jurassic World Alive counterpart, which is a very short, stubby snout. Um, I quite like this one more. Um, and the horns are better as well. I, yeah, I like this. I mean, I don't like the, the lighting and the texture on it. It's kind of boring and bland, but I mean, that's because it's a level 10. But when it gets to level 40, it'll, it'll look different. Um, uh, but I kind of like the base model for that. Actually, I quite like the elongated snout. But there is 4,049. Indira can we just, can we just like, oh god, finally, <laughs> it took so freaking long to get this. And as of today, oh god, it was today, they're in Jurassic World Live, there is Indominus Rex able to be caught in this special event, and Sunday, the next day, there will also be Indoraptor to be caught, so it's a good day for Ludia Games, let me tell you. So we're gonna go quickly to have a look what events we have, we have the Test Your Strength, so we could have Indoraptor versus Indoraptor, uh, size doesn't matter, uh, boosted battle arena, um, Oh, yeah, the Clash of the Titans, which is another one that I need to do. Uh, but now that this is available, I think all of them, yeah, you get the same amount of Monolophosaurus DNA. So I'm kind of glad that I didn't do anything um, extra. I th I, like, I didn't complete the Clash of the Titans event because um, now I can get Monolophosaurus DNA from that instead of Indoraptor DNA as well. We've also got that, but that's aquatic. The, the Indominus Rex event disappeared. I hope you guys managed to get loads of Indominus Rexes and sell them for bucks, because now instead of 9,000, I have 17,000. I didn't go crazy on it, just because I didn't have the time. <laughs> I mean, back in the day when this was like the main game I covered, I would have spent three days straight. We would be on like 50,000 bucks or something. But unfortunately, I, don't, I can't really do that anymore. So we have to say goodbye. For the, for our, to our Indominus Rex, which we've had for the longest time, to fuse it for Indoraptor. We're going to take a little bit of its rib and fuse 
The oh, there it is. See, it's just, it's super DNA. Plus, oh, Indominus Rex, are you ready, guys? This is it, the moment we've all been waiting for. Clickbait, and then it's bait and switch, and there you go. <laughs> I, probably, I hope they put that at the start. If editing, editing James remembered. Um, so here we go. 500, 80 bucks. First time? Oh, second. This is the first time we're seeing red in, in the incubators. Usually it's either blue or purple for the hybrid. Like blue for regular, purple for hybrid, and red for super hybrid. Um, and there it is. We have only... So, well, it came out in June, didn't it? Did it come out in June, the movie? July, August, September, October. Six months later! Almost half a- well, half a year later, we have, since the movie's launch, Indoraptor in the game! Oh, beautiful! So, already level one, 1,772 attack. That is unbelievable! That is crazy! At level one, I might add. So, there it is. Oh, we need to make way! Oh my god, we need to put it, like, there or something. Um, hold on, hold on, hold on. We can, we can hatch it again. So, I'll move all the cone out. We'll go back into- I should get, like, an amazing achievement for this. Oh no, there it is! The Lindo Raptor! Bless! Hold on, hold on. Just had a really- just had a really good idea for a thumbnail, guys. There we go! Uh, and one more, just in case. Sorry for the flashes. That, that- that could be in the thumbnail? Probably not, though. I'll probably just have it when it's in its enclosure. <laughs> And why not? Because we're probably not going to do this again for a while. Hatch it for a second time! Beautiful! So it doesn't automatically get placed. I don't think. Oh, right, there it is. So, boom! Indoraptor is now available to purchase inside the dino market. Um, strange. Oh, that'll be interesting to see how we afford it. So, of course, we don't get any XP. And there she is. So, we'll, t we'll do the interactions because this is a completely new animation. So, what's the friendly? Uh, ooh, I actually can't believe Indoraptor actually has a friendly. <laughs> Uh, and the aggressive. Oh, that was beautiful! It's almost like an intelligent... Like, get away, man. It's almost like it's not really annoyed. It's like, bugger off. That's nice. Nice attention to detail. We'll just have a look at it for a bit just to see its idle animations. I think we've pretty much seen all those. Um, just because of um, when we've watched it in the marketplace. I think you can see all its animations. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Look, because it seems to be doing some cool things. <gasps> Jet black. Evil looking. And now I'm going to ask you guys in the comments, which do you prefer? Indoraptor or Indominus Rex? Uh, so we'll feed it once. So let's see. It's a cool, unique eating animation. Oh, wait, what? Oh. Oh! Oh, what's this? Oh my god. Oh, that was cool. What? <laughs> oh, that's awesome! It has its own unique... Like, that is... They've completely made that themselves. Hats off to you, dude. That was awesome. I want to see that one more time. That was so cool! To see... Like, I wouldn't have ever have thought that that was... I like the claw, though. Because that's from the movie. The claw how it reaches out for Maisie. Don't know about that. It looks like it's eating a giant man of war made of pink meat. <laughs> but, um, we'll see it for the last time. There you go. At level 10, 5,103 health and 2,658 attack. So there's the claw. The claw. And then, uh, you know, a little bit of meat. It should just be one bit of meat. And that, that would do. It doesn't need to... Ooh. I like how we get a lovely close-up of the uh, Ford Explorer. That's quite nice. And that is it. A level 10 Indoraptor. Let's see what the uh, cool fact is for it. The fusion of the Indominus Rex and Velociraptor is possibly one of the most intelligent dinosaurs to ever exist. Um, what do you mean? The fusion of Indominus Rex and Velociraptor? Oh, I guess it's from this game. I was going to say, because it was technically blue and Indominus Rex from the movie. But I, I guess we're doing it for um, for this one. So there it is. And ooh, ooh yes, we get some of that. None of that. None of that either. And um, it said we can buy it in the market. So how much is it? Only 2,000 now, so to unlock it, it's 4,000, so it's only going to take me three months, three months to get another one, <laughs> and then it can be level 20. Um, oh my god, there it is, there it is. So I'm assuming that we need monostegotops, um, so it's monolophosaurus and stegoceratops, right? 
I'm just trying to think. I don't think I have Stegoceratops. I don't even know if I have it out, guys. Uh, let's have a look. I'm sure I do. There it is. There it is. So, oh, there we go. Okay, so we'll get you up. We'll get you up. So we already got level... I've got enough to make a level um, 40. But we don't have it all. Now, I'm not going to spend bucks. I'm not going to waste it because... We're not getting Monostegatops for another six months, half a year. It will be 2019 by the time we have Monostegatops. Wow, that's depressing. <laughs> but, I mean, I'm not going to waste bucks because even if I get the level 40, it makes no difference. But, yes! Now that we... Yeah, we're even closer. So that was one of the things to get was Indoraptor. So only now I need... I got 32 out of 36, so I need four more, which is Ceratosaurus, which I can easy make. Dilophosaurus level 40, which I can easy make. Um, the fish I can easy make. And um, this one, Ehrlichosaurus. I can make them all. Holy! So let's get Ehrlichosaurus, um, Ceratosaurus, and the fish. Okay, let, that's what we're going to do. This is going to help us, and we're going to max out the trophy. <gasps> yes! Awesome. Okay, so... Um, what was it? It was Dilophosaurus, but there was Ehrlichosaurus first, right? So we go herbivores. I think it was Ehrlichosaurus. I definitely remember what its face looked like. So there's Monostegatops. Uh, it wasn't Um uh, There it is, Ehrlichosaurus. So 7,000 DNA for that. Okay, I probably shouldn't have put that in first, but hey. I'm an idiot. Uh, what were the other ones? Um, fish and Ceratosaurus. So uh, we'll go carnivores. We'll go over to here. And Ceratosaurus. Ah, I saw a hunch over like, uh, Now we need to go to caves. And I think I've already got it. There it is, this one. So level 25. We only need level ones. And Dilophosaurus. Dilophosaurus. Oh, I'm trying to think of um, what they say in the, in the tour. So what, what do we have of Dilophosaurus? Hold on. Um, spitting blinding venom at its prey. Blinding them and eventually causing paralysis. This makes Dilophosaurus a deadly yet beautiful addition to Jurassic Park. So we need a level 40. Um, oh, yeah, there we go. Okay, so we'll just level this guy up to level 10. And that's it. Within a week of the tournament creatures being done, we will have the max trophy and Indominus Rex with the biggest range to get all of them. Oh, I love it. Dil I love this Dilophosaurus. I love the Jurassic Park Dilophosaurus. I know... It's maybe not scientifically accurate. The real Dilophosaurus had a longer snout with a more hook at the end, and it was way bigger. But I had something about this Dilophosaurus I just love. I don't know what it is. I really do like that. Um, but we're not going to just hatch Indominus, Endoraptor, sorry. We've spent all this time. No, of course, we're going to use it, dear. Now, test your strength. We, we need Indominus Rex against Indominus Rex. Uh, size doesn't matter. Three super rares. Okay, uh, we could do that one. One amphibian. Hoo -hoo! <laughs> it's gonna be three Gorgosauruses all the time, isn't it? So, we'll, we'll, we'll go through this. Um, I kind of want to do Indominus Rex, so Indoraptor, against one of those, but we'll not, because it'll, ju it'll just be kind of a waste. So, I'll just quickly speed through this um, and do these vents. And then on this one, when it's like, use a hybrid, we'll use Indoraptor and see what it's like, like Indoraptor versing. Indoraptor. Um, it, I don't think it can kill itself in two hits. So it'll be very close if it can. So that's one. Um, I think that's just pretty much one because we need three to kill it and it might just have three block. Oh, only one. Boosh. And there you go. First one done straight. So guys, have you got your Indoraptor? And if not, how close are you to getting Indoraptor? So we're going to have comments filled with I like Indoraptor better. I like Indominus Rex better. And then, I'm so much off this Indoraptor. I've got Indoraptor. <laughs> That's all the comments are going to be. <laughs> oh, I love you guys. Oh, dear. It's my own bloody fault. Spam the comments. Like the video. Millions of likes, please. <laughs> I honestly don't think likes affect the video. If I've got to be honest. Uh, oh, wait, what? Why do you do that? 100, 200, 300. Oh, okay. So maybe, maybe I can't kill him in three. I'd be surprised if the third gives me an extra 100. Okay, that's good. That's good. So he's got a possibility of one block. We've got one, two, three. Oh, no. Would have killed him. So, strangely enough, uh, I could have got, like, one on the second go there. That was interesting. Okay. That's another 50 DNA. Uh, the super rare uh, post Sucus. We'll go for one. Actually, no. Go for one hit, please. Just speed it up. Damn it. Okay. So we'll go for two reserve. And... He's only got three. Please don't go for three. 
Oh, uh, well, never mind. Two, two's enough. <laughs> it was worth a shot. I could have done it. Um, anything else that can kill themselves in, like, two hits? Uh, Velociraptor's pretty darn close. I don't think it can, though. Because it'll be 432. Um, and I don't think it'll do an extra 100 knots. So I'll just go for three reasons. It's the best way, because... I got so many dinosaurs, and I might as well just rattle through them. And it doesn't matter if I lose. So, yes, guys. I am as exhausted as anything. Uh, I know, right? For the first 60 minutes of the video, like, wow, you seem really chipper today, Beavers. Fantastic. You just put a sunshine up me ass. <laughs> it made me feel great. <laughs> um, but no, like... Yesterday, I played I played the Dark Souls board game. Now, if you don't know what that, if you know what Dark Souls is, just imagine it in board game form. And if you don't know what Dark Souls is, I, I'm sorry for you. <laughs> just imagine Dungeons and Dragons, something like that. Um, so, me and my friend, um, we we started at ten o'clock. We did a run for two hours, died, wasted. So we we had a break, did whatever, and at four thirty. Oh, is this legendary? It must be legendary. Okay, I'm not using interrupter for this one. Um, Actually, yeah, sod it. Let's use Interrupter. So, oh my god, it is, it's top five. It's top five. <laughs> oh my god, did it get a buff? It's top five dinosaurs, and I have pretty much maxed all the best hybrids. And it's level 10. Okay. Okay, that's awesome. Well, there you have it, eh? <laughs> we'll go for one reserve, because uh, I don't think he'll go for two. Indoraptor versus Indoraptor. Oh, he went for one! Bam! Okay, we'll slow it down so we get to see his animation of three. Um, you know what I'd like to do? Is see the seven animation. That'd be pretty cool. So there you go. Here's the three one. Woo! Just a little run. Actually, no. The seven just to jump and, like, chomp on them, isn't it? Oh, and the victory animation is the same as Jurassic World Alive as well. Just the only differences, I think that one is different, the three, and the death. Instead of it, like, falling over towards the uh, dinosaur, it falls away. And it costs 280 bucks to get it back. So it's not that. Um, but yeah, so we started half four. And we, were going, we did a normal playthrough Dark Souls. We did main boss. Sorry, mini boss, main boss, and mega boss. Because there's a new DLC out for it. Um, now, on the... <laughs> <laughs> on the game, it says 60 to 90 minutes playtime on the bo on the box. And then if you want to do the mega boss, 30 to 60 minutes. So potentially it's two and a half hours. Do you want to know how long we played it for? 12 hours. We finished the game a quarter to five in the morning. From it, it took, we started at half four and finished at half five. It was a whole day almost. Oh, no, not half five, half four. So, yeah, it was it was literally 12 hours. Oh, my God. I, I, we, had, we had loads of fun. Um, but it was, like, two in the morning. And we're, like, we just completed the main boss and the mini boss. And we just had the mega boss left to go. And we're, like, well, we've come all this way. We've basically got all these items. If we put this stuff away, because it's a big, big-ass thing, you know, <laughs> having this whole uh, setup on, on, like, a table. So, we're like, well... We have to take pictures of all the equipment. We have to take pictures of our stats. And then, oh, just, just let's do it. So we wanted to play it anyway. But, oh, my God, it was five in the morning by the time um, my friend left. And, um, oh, yes. Awesome. DNA rewards. Hell, yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It would, they would all be a thousand. But, of course, for some reason, it's decided to be cheapy. And I don't get anything that time. So, well... That was Indoraptor. Bloody no. Okay, custom. Um, was it just three super? Are you kidding me? Really? Only three super rares? Yeah, there you go. Awesome. So let's just go for one reserve. Um, so it's going to take us three months to get Indoraptor and another half a year, so six months, to get. Um, what do you call it? Uh, Monostegatops. So. Um, it's going to be a long time. It's going to be a long time. So I'm hoping for Christmas. In another month, we'll get. Um, aquatic hybrids, or glacier hybrids, or both. That would be really cool, um, because it's going to take me, you know, until 2019 to get level 20 Indoraptor. And to be honest, actually, after seeing how, how good Indoraptor is, I don't mind it taking that long, because it takes way longer to get any other dinosaur, uh, like to get a, re a dinosaur that level, to get a level 40 Cerizinosaurus starting out, 
you know, with all the DNA I accumulated over all, like, the three years of playing, three years of playing this game, that's what I've got to show for it, is all my dinosaur team. For six months, I have the fifth best dinosaur in the game. I have Indoraptor for six months. Three years it took me to get everything else. So, yeah. Actually, you know what? The grind, worth it. Indoraptor's pretty darn good. So we'll do one, one more suit. Oh, wait, what? Uh, all right. Well, this is a bit tough, isn't it? <laughs> I don't know if we've done this one. Um, Because it's 17,000. Are you serious? What am I supposed to do here? Like, 17,000. Oh, you, you can't. If it was any other type of dinosaur, uh, because it's a super rare, I'm going to have to exit out and go back in, make sure he doesn't kill me, and then go for three reserve, one block. Hopefully he doesn't kill me again. And then just go for one block and then seven attack and just do as much damage as I can do to him as possible. That's the only way I can do this. Oh my god, that's a... Like, that's the thing, right? There's no way you can do that. Super res. Even if you had four Ankylodocuses maxed up, or Ankylodoci maxed up against Pachygalosaurus, you're not winning. So this, to me, doesn't make any sense whatsoever. Um, so we'll go for that because we've got 500. Hopefully he doesn't go for anything. Um, he's got three. You can go for one. You can go for two. Uh, one's fine. That's good. Okay. Good, good, good. So now I'm going to go for three block, four reserve. Come on, come on, come on. We got this, we got this, we got this. So five. Um, he, it's probably attacking numbers, I would say. Oh, four. That's fine. He's got one block. So potentially, we could hit all seven here. So for seven, we do 7,000 damage. That's not, that's not even half. Oh, no, it is. It is over half. Never mind. Okay, please don't block. It didn't block. Yes. Bam. Okay, 7,000. It isn't even over half. Oh, my God. It isn't even over half. There's the only way you can do this. There's no other way. Look, did you test this? Do you test these at tournaments? You can put me against Pachycalosaurus, or you know, this this event. There's no way of doing it. You've just teased a pack. That's all you've done. Unless you, if you didn't know how to cheat, you wouldn't do this. You wouldn't know how to do it. Um, so again, one block, three reserve. Um, he blocks for four. Actually, that's all of his attacks. That's good. So maybe we won't have to exit out um, right now. No, we do because we're dead. And like I said, if, you've, if you're used to doing this tactic and you've been watching these videos for quite some time, um, you'll know that you need to have two dinosaurs in your team. Otherwise, they will go for max attack every time. And we don't want that now, do we? So that's what we got to do. we got to keep Stegoceratops in. Make sure we have one block. If we do die, exit out. And then he'll think that we've got nothing. Go for the minimum. Um, and do that. So, one, two, three, four. One, two, three. Oh, so, I, I mean, I've been talking for, all, like, so many hours yesterday. I was talking to my friend. Um, and my voice wears out now. Like, because of Assassin's Creed, recording for hours. Because of Jurassic World Evolution, recording for hours. Um, and, um, and now I'm doing another job. Um, and... It's, you know, it's only once a week, so it's not going to subtract from YouTube at all. And some people are like, oh, you've got another job, Beavers. Yes, I do. I'm not going to tell you what it is in case you're stalkers. <laughs> and we, we've got to exit one more time or else uh, he's, he's not going to survive. I mean, we're not going to survive. Um, we could possibly survive with, you know, Stegoceratops going for a hit, but then we'd have to go for like four or five because we only do like 300. Um, so this should be technically the last time I exit out. Should be. That was it. That should be it. Um, we'll see what he's got, because otherwise I might do. I might need to do one more just in case I'm not 100% confident that uh, Stegoceratops can kill it. Um, but yeah, and like, oh, I just need to. I need like. This is the thing. When I was doing that hungry, hungry shark thing, I was swim, swimming with sharks in Florida. Um, there was somebody from Glee uh, with us. I can't remember her name now. Um, and, I mean, if you go back to, like, 2017, was it, was it 2018? Was it this year? No. No, no, it was last year. Um, Shark Week, and you go, last year, Shark Week 2017, Discovery Channel, you'll probably find the shark diving thing that I did, and I can't remember what her name is, but she was, she was from Glee, and she was saying because she uses her voice all the time, 
for singing. Some days she doesn't talk at all, just to rest her voice. And honestly, because I'm doing all of this and it's so intense, it is like singing and I'm projecting my voice all the time. Um, I need a day to just rest. I, I just need to not talk for a day because it's, it's, oh God. <laughs> but anyway, there we go. We did the impossible bloody event by cheating. Good Lord. Indoraptors, monostegatops, impossible events. What more could you want? And there is Demorphodon. Oh my days. So that's another 1,300 VIP points. We did get some VIP points for um, getting uh, all the Indominus Rexes. It was like 1,100 uh, or 1,700 it was. Maybe 1,100 um, for each Indominus Rex. And there was about maybe nine I won. So that's over 12,000, 11,000 DNA, uh, sorry, VIP points I got from that. So that's good. Um, and I made all the books back because I sold them. Um, so now that we've done two events, we can go in here and collect 24 Indoraptor DNA and 24 Monostegatops Mono DNA. Um, so the only things we've got left to do is a boosted battle event. Um, Clash of Titans, which we've got 31 out of 28, so it's, it's actually locked me out now. <laughs> but if you exit out the game and come back in, it'll be fine. Um, so I've got this one, which is one amphibian, and we, uh, I'm not, I'm not going to bother, and this one, which is pretty easy. Um, th this one's going to be tough eventually when it's just three amphibians and you need to do Gorga Sutures, Ostoposaurus, and Presta Sutures. If, okay, I'll not do this just because my voice is worn out and we've pretty much done everything. <laughs> um, but if you're going to do this one, I would say one amphibian at the end and start with two good flyers, kill them. Then, um, not your best flyers, then start with your best flyer. So Metro, oh sorry, start with a really, so you say, first battle. Um, a really weak amphibian and then two of your second best flyer and your third best flyer. In this case, it would be um, Pterodactylus and Edamorphodon. That's going to win your first fight. Your second battle, go for a really weak uh, amphibian so that you get three reserves on your next turn. Then go for um, Metrophodon and then uh, uh, any other... Uh, amphibian that's not too great and for your final battle because it'll be three amphibians go for uh probably backwards or go press sutures then your strongest gorga sutures and then your second strongest ostoposaurus and that will win you that and if you're in trouble exit out do it there you go but anyway guys and you've got boosters if you need to use them but that's it we've done indoraptor we've, we've shown the monostegatops and that's it. Oh my god. Almost half an hour. Wow. Okay. Oh, I'm exhausted. I'm ready to go to sleep now. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for all the support that you've shown uh, this channel, uh, this series, all the other series. If you stick with this Assassin's Creed, Jurassic World Evolution, if you've got a favorite, that's awesome. Um, and I can't thank you enough for it. It's honestly, it's... I love it. I love doing this. It's, 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 like it's a good time for me. Anyway, anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video... Leave a like and until next time, I'll see you later. Bye bye.